Welcome back in this morning to WTY 11 your day. We are outside right now having some fun with the folks from the Imagination Station. Join with me right now is Sarah. Sarah, what do we have in store for today? Good morning. Well, I thought that we would do something fun with rockets. All right, it's really nice outside, so this is a good activity. Now, um, I've got some water in the speaker here, and I'm going to have you throw in three of these tablets. Okay. Do you recognize those tablets? Uh, it looks like uh, a simple Alka-Seltzer tablet. Yeah, so go okay. ahead and throw those in. What's All cool, three right into there? Yeah. What's cool about Alka-Seltzer is that it has um, citric acid and sodium bicarbonate, which is an acid and a base mm -hmm. in our tablet. But of course they don't react until we add them to water and then mm -hmm. they release carbon dioxide gas. So we can actually trap that gas inside a balloon and fill up our balloon with that carbon dioxide. Now normally this carbon dioxide gas, it's invisible. We can't see it. So right. we're actually capturing the effects of this by the balloon yeah. getting larger. So it's pretty cool. We can actually see that there is a reaction happening. Okay, so I'm gonna set this off to the side. And um, what I've got here is a film canister. Now, most kids these days don't know what a film canister yeah. is. Phil, right? what's that? Right. I just take pictures with my digital camera, right? right? My, my iPhone yeah. and all kinds of stuff. Um, but what we can do with a film canister is it creates this really nice tight seal, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna put some water into the bottom of our canisters here. And then I'm gonna give you a tablet and okay. I'm gonna hold on to one. We're gonna drop our tablets in and snap that lid on. Okay. All right. There you go and then flip that over on the table. So again, we're causing that chemical reaction. Oh. <laughs> we're causing that chemical reaction where we actually filled up that container with so much carbon dioxide gas that it created a ton of pressure and eventually our canister couldn't hold the pressure anymore. So and it was a rocket then. Exactly. We so sent it airborne. Pretty cool, right? That's Newton's third law of motion, okay? Now, one or two is pretty fun to do, but what if we do 100. All right. All right. That sounds way cooler, right? Now, we saw how fast that happened. So can you imagine us trying to fill 100 of these and snap all the lids on? I mean, I, by the time we got to number five, the first one. Yeah, I don't think we would do be able to do that in time. Right. I mean, we're not that fast, right? So what we've got here is we're using the same canister, but this time we've actually glued a magnet onto the lid. Okay. All right. And we've glued the Alka-Seltzer to the inside. So I'm going to steal your water. We're going to fill this up again. Same thing, we're gonna snap that lid on and now I've got it on a tray. So what I can do with this, so I'm gonna use that magnet to actually pick up all of these rockets. Oh. All right, there we go. And now I have one for you. So now we have 100 rockets ready to go. Okay, so go ahead, we, put we on mean, your face We mean shield. business now. Yeah, we're getting extreme. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. So go ahead and pick that up. And one, two, three. All right. So you can see all that fizzing action in there. Just like the first time, we don't know when it's and gonna I'm happen. And supposed to just hold it? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I would have brought the raincoat too if I would have known. Another successful science experiment. Pretty Sarah, cool. appreciate your time. Thank you so much. You guys always busy at the Imagination Station. What's the latest yes. now? Um, we actually have grossology happening, and tomorrow we're talking animal grossology from 12 to 4. The Toledo Zoo is going to come down and join us and talk about all the gross stuff the animals Not do. Not the cow eyeball again. Not the cow eyeball all right. again. Carl was terrorizing me with that a few weeks ago. All right, well, thank you so You're much. Welcome. You guys always busy down there across the street. We are busy as well here. And we'll be right back with more WT11, your day right after this.